Hello, this is another Chessex Pound of D6 unboxing, I guess. With us is, well, with us this time anyway, it's Tony Batman. <clears throat> Pardon me. Right, so looking at it right away, I can see way too many of the uh, red dice with yellow pips and the yellow dice with red pips. Um, can see a bit of a variety though. Uh, the previous order was um, quite an amazing pull. So, regardless, I should be fine with this one. They'll be going into that jar there. And when that jar is full, I'll be separating out the solid colors and the speckles from the uh, swirly colors and translucents. Yeah, all right, you ready? Here we go. So let's separate these out by size first. I hope people are having a, an amazing spring. Only a few days into it and the weather's already greatly improved. Now this one here, um, Normally when we get uh, dice of this size, they're either green or red. This is the first time we've gotten a yellow. Sometimes they're a solid flat color, sometimes they're a bit uh, pearlescent like this one. The variety on these uh, really small ones, even though we don't get that many, which is fine, is always quite nice. <clears throat> okay. So I've seen the Snyder cut four times now. I think it's quite amazing. I really hope they restored the uh, the whole Snyder vs. Cannon or whatever. He seems. He doesn't seem to know what he's doing. He doesn't know what he's doing. He uh, he's written quite a few comic books and the like. So I believe he's the guy for the job. Oh, that's gross. Way too many of those red ones. All right. Um. So let's put these in order here. Well, in these eight count order. Oh, you know what, um, we were recently gifted this amazing set of dice, I don't know where it's from, but when I'm done separating these dice here, I'm going to pull them out so I can show you when this is all wrapped up. Oh man, wow. Way too many. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, we got them, but let's finish with these counts. Next we'll do the yellows. And the rest of them appear to be uh, translucent and um, swirled colors. Really, except for the uh, that big yellow one and that overabundance of these red and 
yellow ones. This almost seems like a duplicate of our um, previous pull. So I remember um, for the first time we saw these purple ones, which are quite nice. And uh, we also got some of these really nice translucent um, blue. Some of them have purple in it, anything like that. Those are quite nice. And I thought I spotted, yeah, huh, one lone speckled uh, dice here. Right, so let's uh, separate the purples now. And the uh, Suicide Squad trailer, I believe, dropped today. I saw that, and that was pretty cool. I'd like to see uh, James Gunn at the helm. I know uh, he's responsible for Guardians of the Galaxies, but he uh, got a start in Troma Pictures and did some pretty cool films in that. If you look closely, and if you know who he is, you'll spot a cameo by Lloyd Kaufman in uh, the first Guardians of the Galaxy movie. Um, looks like these blue swirly ones here will be next up. I remember I had a hard time separating them uh, last time because they vary so much in uh, dimension, I guess you'd say. So we're just going to separate them all out here. Like so. So as you can see, some of them have like nice little things of purple and green. There's more of purple. Here's one that's uh, really light and green. These are a bit darker with just white in them, so maybe we'll separate these. Like so. Alright, so we put all of these together like this. But they vary so much. Oh well. We'll just call them all the same style. Then we've got these uh, blue ones with the white swirls. Okay, I did separate these out, right? These uh, have purple pips and the other one, um, I'm sorry. These have silver pips and the other ones have white pips. Okay. Got these uh, nice swirly black and red dice with gold pips. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, I think you'd belong over here. Um, okay, we'll put these oranges over here. Looks like we left you guys out. So we'll put you over here. Got three of these. We'll do it like this. Got two of you. <coughs> And one of each of you. Okay, so let's uh, take a look at these all together. As you can see, we've got the one big die. This time it's yellow. Normally it's either red or green. Got a nice little handful of the smaller dice. Way too many of these red ones, but these will just be uh, used as filler for that. A little too many of these yellow ones. A little bit less of these purple ones. Nice amount though, and I like the style. Same with these uh, translucent, translucent blue ones. These are a bit different translucent blue with uh, white streaks in them. Got red and black. <clears throat> Lightly swirly orange. And this is a interesting color here. Not sure how to describe it. <coughs> then we have these last ones here. So now let's count it all up. <coughs> let's see.
Wow. All right. Um, so I think this is uh, probably one of my largest pools. This is 109 dice. Really decent variety. Just way too much of those, but uh, for all that dice and just getting a chunk of these, that's really not too bad. So um, I'm happy with this. Time to put these all in here. Oh, yes, and uh, we still have some separate dice to show you. I don't, uh, I don't believe these have anything to do with the Chess X line. As a matter of fact, I'm just gonna say I'm uh, positive that they're not from Chess X. But we were gifted this cute little box here. And we got a nice set here, five dice. Now, if you look closely, you can see that uh, the pips are recessed and they're these tiny little skulls. This is pretty incredible. It almost feels like these are wood. I can't be sure though. Um, and that's really from the, the feel of it. It's probably not though. It'd be hard to keep those skulls intact and everything else. Funny story, the very first roll I did with these dice, like right after getting them and I tossed them, we got two sixes, no wait, we got, <laughs> we got four threes and a six, that would be six, 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 kind of cool for the score dice, yeah, they have a nice teft to them, um, they feel a bit lighter than the wood at that size though, which is why I thought maybe they could be wood. These are brilliant though. I hope to find a proper way to display them somehow. Okay, so um, while the variety wasn't up to standard, we got something like 109 dice in this with uh, three different sizes. So that's pretty incredible. Again, this has been and then packaging for the Chess X pound of D6s. Hope you enjoy your spring. Take care of yourselves, stay healthy, and always be kind. Thanks.